Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The end products of anaerobic respiration are lactic acid or ethanol and ATP molecules. Anaerobic respiration takes place in the absence of oxygen and is seen in lower animals. During the process of anaerobic respiration in prokaryotes, there is a breakdown of glucose to produce energy for cellular activities. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. In anaerobic respiration, glucose breaks down without oxygen. The chemical reaction transfers energy from glucose to the cell. Anaerobic respiration produces lactic acid, rather than carbon dioxide and water. Take our lead. Fermentation is another anaerobic, non-oxygen requiring pathway for breaking down glucose, one that's performed by many types of organisms and cells. In fermentation, the only energy extraction pathway is glycolysis, with one or two extra reactions tacked on at the end. Take our lead. Anaerobic respiration happens in muscles during hard exercise. Glucose is not completely broken down, so less energy is released than during aerobic respiration. There is a buildup of lactic acid in the muscles during vigorous exercise. Make your mark, take our lead. These little guys have been used everywhere from my old lab to wine, beer, and bread making. They convert sugars present in foods into ethanol and carbon dioxide. These sugars range from maltose and barley for beer, glucose and fructose in grapes for wine, or starch in wheat for bread. Take our lead. Another advantage of anaerobic respiration is its speed. It produces ATP very quickly. For example, it lets your muscles get the energy they need for short bursts of intense activity, see figure below. Aerobic respiration, on the other hand, produces ATP more slowly. Make your mark! Take our lead. Respiration is the process of gas exchange between the air and an organism's cells. Three types of respiration include internal, external, and cellular respiration. External respiration is the breathing process. It involves inhalation and exhalation of gases. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.